Hi, and welcome to another hopefully short video about new games coming out on Steam, or right now new on Steam, which I think you should know about. Let's get started. First off, we have Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. This has been very public, very loud, coming out November 15th. I am a Star Wars fan, I'm an open world action game fan, and this seems very good on multiple fronts, yet I can't help but feel trepidation and feel concerned, even though it's respawn, that this might not be all it's cracked up to be, uh, especially from what I heard from people who got to see it up close and personal. So I'll probably play it, I'll probably buy it, but I'll, I'm not sure when. And I mostly recommend to wait for premiers and wait for actual reviews. Second up. Why is it so slow? Sniper Ghost Warrior Contracts. I very much like sniping games in general, and Sniper Ghost Warrior is a series I like very much. I especially like the new, the, the last one that came out, which was actually a few months ago, uh, Sniper Ghost Warrior 3. This looks like a Sniper Ghost Warrior if it was Hitman. I mean, if it was based on the uh, Hitman uh, mission system, because that's what it looks like. You get contracts, individual missions, which you can think about how, to, how you want to do them individually and do them again in different ways. Uh, since I like sniping, I like Sniper Ghost Warrior, I thought I'd mention this. It definitely looks as good as Snip Sniper Ghost Warrior 3, and looks interesting. Number 3 is The Thirteenth Doll, which is a fan game for The Seventh Guest, which came out of the blue for me. Uh, it's out now. It's a fan game that started as a freeware project, but end up, ended up a fully licensed game. So if you like The Seventh Guest, if you miss those FMV puzzle games, uh, if you like running around solving strange and weird puzzles, you should probably check it out. And it's not that expensive, it's about $27 now with 10% off. And last one, just for kicks, the Disney Classic Games, released just a few days ago. Uh, Aladdin, Aladdin and the Lion King all in one package with some enhancements. And I actually really like those games, I played them a lot when I was a kid. Uh, but now you can play them in high definition, I guess, and with uh, several improvements, all the different versions. If you're a Disney fan, if you like those classics, if you want to play them again, if you haven't played them when you were young, then you should at least check it out. The music in Aladdin is especially good. I like it a lot. Okay, that was me. Uh, my name is Aran. I'm the Saber Runner. This is my group, Saber Runner Gaming, available at bit.ly uh, slash srgaming. Steam and a follow would be greatly appreciated. I uh, collect all these reviews that I do, all those informational things. And if you want to follow me, you can follow me on Facebook, which is Saber Runner Gaming or bit.ly uh, slash srgaming. Thank you and see you next week.